started. All right, he's, yeah, he's back to pause. Here, you guys can slide over. Okay. All right. This mic is actually. Don't they usually play? Uh, doesn't he usually play Falco? Uh, Net? Yeah, I guess. It's just Amos. kind of a a mixed pack of nets. You never really know what he's gonna yeah. do. He like I don't know. He he falls victim to like the scrub mentality in Utah, where it's like I don't like this matchup. Switching here yeah. instead of just landing. I put on a lot of it. Yeah, I've never been one to do that. Really. Couch really bad. Or couch really bad. Yeah, I think. Yeah. But no, I think well in this game especially like. The matchups are not like the games are not. There's a way to win every matchup. Yeah. Uh, well, probably. I, I'm not going to win every matchup. Well, probably. I mean, I don't know. Ice there's really peaches. hard matchups. Ice's Peach is pretty bad. But yeah, there's a way to win. Yeah, I mean. It's, uh, so, yeah, I know Rocky's drunk. I'm really actually happy. <laughs> I think Palmer's still super loses. I don't know how he, you know, he does switches and stuff. Like. He plays Falcon until he loses. Until it's like scary for him. Unless he's a winner. Is there a reason for that? Does he just have more fun that way? He... Yeah, I think he has more fun and I think he just wants to like level up his Falcon. Okay. Dash tag? Falcon's dash attack actually uh, slides you off the stage. Ammon took advantage of it. So whenever I watch Ammon, I just feel like he just kind of runs over and just like, does random things. Um, I, I don't, I'm, they work. It, it, it'll look like that. Ammon's spacing is so good that he can, can that. he can afford to like draw kind of a lot of moves, and both of his characters allow him to do that because they have such good like. Yeah, Luigi yeah. having uh, great aerials and Falcon having good air mobility and good aerials. Oh, it should be it, right? Yeah, but yeah. Ammon's recovery is good. Yeah. I like uh, Nets' decision there. He knew he couldn't get it. Right now, so just... Whoa! Oh, uh, oh, okay. Ooh. I thought that. Uh, oh, it's probably. You never want to take him there. <laughs> Trevor, what is Ammon? I feel like Ammon's ledge game used to be. Ammon's ledge game used to be so much better in Eternal, but he's a lot now. Yeah. He yeah. had not have like more opportunities yeah. to win. Like, I feel like I was edge guarding, he was just choosing an option a little too soon. Like, yeah, well, I mean, he's, he's playing a character. Play. Like his instincts and reactions are going to be as on point as to where like you are. Yeah. I think that's the price you pay for like juggling characters like that. Like I think it's important to learn what other characters can do, but you still gotta you still gotta stick your game. It's just like all that time wasted, you know. Like, that was a good tech choice you did. Fabric Pack can't do anything about that. Shoutouts to Tyson for naming Green Fox Clown Shoes. Clown Shoes. I prefer Clown Shoes. Clown Shoes is pretty good. I miss Tyson. Where the fuck is he? This is like the, uh, this is kind of a grindy counter kick against Falcon. It's like no one really likes playing on the stage, but unless you're like Sheik or Marth. But, I don't know. But you play Sheik. I play now. Oh, okay. Okay. <laughs> um, yeah, my opinion is in that one. I was going to say, I don't really have an answer for that. I don't know too many nets. Um, I don't know. Oh, it's like, uh, Foxes don't really like the stage, but they're just like, this is, it's, I don't think it's as bad for Falcon as it is as Yoshi's is, but I think it's hard to play on. I think a lot of Falcons go to Yoshi's. Like, you try to play Rocky or you try to play Yoshi's. Who are you playing? That's, but I, I always ban Dreamland. 
they at that stage. They should go FD. But they don't. They always do Yoshi, what I'm saying. I know, they should go FD. FD is not good for Sheik. Ever? Any matchup? Not really one that I can think of. No. No. <laughs> that is my go-to counter pick against Sheik. Why is that? Uh, because Sheik really suffers when you get under her, under her, and there's no platforms for her to win. Yeah, for her to like use a neutral. Yeah. So if you get under, all her aerials are crash cancel. I guess she's kind of a bad player. Yeah, and you can you can cover the fucking mess out of her. Like the chain grab. I don't know. Like the tech chase. Like. With Sheik, it doesn't matter when there's platforms too much. Yeah, because, because it never. It yeah. yeah, it never goes. You're right. But with a stage like this, though, it was because of the platforms come on. Yeah, but they can. Uh, chain grab it, or doing that tech chase is really hard. So I feel like sometimes this stage kind of gives you, like, train moves. And, like, the platforms. Uh, so if you're like if you suddenly get onto a platform and she's tech chasing you, it limits where you can tech, right? Yeah. So she can kind of just cover it all. But I, I can't really like Sheik is probably the top tier I know the least about. Like the least. So why do you like FOD? What's up? Why do you like FOD the Sheik? The Sheik against two. Just uh, in spaces. Uh, spaces, if they can shield up, I hate FOD. Okay, so you hate FOD against me. Yeah. Fox, Fox, I just... Fox, Fox is fine. Because uh, Fox can't uh, get away with this bull jump bull crap on FOD. I can call it out and I can punish pretty easily. Uh, Falco is just fucking. Uh, Falco can shield up, Falco wins like 70 30. On I'm the making this guy stage. hate Falco a lot. <laughs> No, like, uh, I've had a couple other Falcos that did, like, super technical shit dropping Falcos, and they just fucked me up on the stage. Because yeah. your one advantage of being under them is no longer an advantage anymore. So, against Marth, I hate it, too. Uh, I'd like it against Falcon and Fox and Fodies. So, I guess, I guess I should, I meant to ask, like, why does every sheet seem to make this stage just, like, go-to? Like, what makes you like it? Against, uh, Falcon, um... It's that I can CC, I can force him into situations where he has no choice but to attack me, and I can CC grab and kill him off it. Uh, against Fox, the uh, same thing, he can't full jump uh, and get away with that. Um, it's also, I feel, even though there is a, um, a wall, it's uh, really easy in a shard box on a Cody. Because he can't escape the platforms, I can still hit him if he goes to the platforms. Yeah. Um, Top platform small, so it's, it's really easy to. And off, you die. Kill him off there. And then I. Survivability off the sides, fine, whatever, she can. Then well, your blast zones are favored for you. Yeah, blast zones are definitely favored for me. Yeah. So I actually lo was looking at the stages on my frame melee app, and FOD is like trivial, trivial like not even noticeable, uh, higher than that. Like it's two feet. Apparently, it's like yeah, half a it's, box. It's not much. So. But the, the, the difference is that the platform um, relative to like the the uh, the blast zone though, like FOD's platforms are a lot lower than that. Yeah. So you don't you won't die from that smash on the top platform at like seventy. Dare. Oh. Battlefield actually has the highest top platform in the game. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Is that a tech or a video? Uh, that's true. You can see the little, like, like, like the splash. light. Yeah. Oh. SH is really like, against Peach, too, as Sheik. I feel like Peaches always go there. So. Uh, against Sheik, I would say it's the Sheik's favor. Okay. Because right. Peach normally controls the, uh, the diagonal down. And uh, it's, it's kind of awkward for her if you're in the... Um, if you're in the corner, she can't really pressure you. I mean, she can down smash on platform, but she can crouch under that. Yeah. So and then use poker with up tilts and like forward tilts okay. uh, in there, uh, and she shields good enough to withstand that yeah. down smash anyways. So she can't really pressure you in the corner. So it's one of the few times being in the corner against Peach is not bad yeah. on FOD. If she has center stage, she's still like winning it a little bit, but it's yeah. hard for her to come in, and it's it's not as dangerous for you to be in the corner against her. So and then you and you can grab uh, Peach a lot. She's not floating. She's not uh, doing as many attacks on FOD. She's usually trying to get positioning. And if you can call her out, that you can grab her shield and then punch her for it. Yeah, my me melee knowledge is definitely lacking. I usually just play a little 
the reason why people go there is it's like, oh, he'll run into my platform and I'll jump smash him. But as long as you don't get hit by that, yeah, you can grab and fuck her up. All right, is anyone even watching this shit? I guess some people are watching this.